Maputo, previously named Lorenko Marques until 1976, is the capital and most popular city of Mozambique. The city is named after Chief Maputo I of the Tembe clan and a subgroup of the Songa people. Like Lagos, Nigeria, Maputo city is the geographically smallest and most densely populated province in Mozambique. Also, it is a port city with an economy centered on commerce. It is also noted for its vibrant cultural scene and distinctive eclectic architecture. Before we continue with this video, kindly subscribe to our channel if you're new here. Also turn on our notifications to always get notified each time we drop a video. Stay tuned. Located near the southern end of Mozambique is the city of Maputo. It is positioned within 120 km of Eswatini and South Africa borders. The city has a population of 1.7 million as of 2017, distributed over a land area of 347.69 km square. Maputo is placed on a large natural bay on the Indian Ocean, near where the rivers Tembe, Mbuluzi, Matola, and Infulene converge. This cosmopolitan city has several languages like Bantu, Songa, and Changana, and more, with Portuguese being the most common, and to a lesser extent, Arabic, Indian, and Chinese languages and cultures are present in the city. Maputo has a healthful climate tempered by sea breezes. Its fine bathing beaches made it a popular resort for white South Africans and Rhodesians before Mozambique became independent in 1975. Thereafter, revenues from tourism, once a major economic factor, virtually dropped. Maputo has a number of landmarks including Independence Square, City Hall, Maputo Fortress, the Central Market, Tunduru Gardens and Maputo Railway Station. Maputo is known as an aesthetically attractive city. With wide avenues lined by jacaranda and acacia trees, it has earned the nickname City of Acacias at the Pearl of the Indian Ocean. The city is known for its distinct eclectic architecture with Portuguese colonial neoclassical and Manueline styles alongside modern art deco, Bauhaus and brutalist buildings. Maputo has a vibrant cultural scene with many restaurants, music and performance venues and local film industry. Several colleges and universities are located in Maputo, including Pedagogical University, Sao Thomas University, Catholic University of Mozambique and Eduardo Maudlin University, the oldest in the country. Maputo's economy is centered around its ports, through which much of Mozambique's imports and exports are shipped. The port, one of the most important in East Africa before independence, handled transit trade from mines and industries of South Africa, Swaziland and Rhodesia, with which it has rail and road connections. After the frontier with Rhodesia was closed, and as Mozambique's South African relations became increasingly strained, the port suffered. Presently, the port is flourishing, and its chief exports include cotton, sugar, chromite, sisal, copper and hardwood. In addition to trade, the city has robust manufacturing and service sectors. Local industries include brewing, shipbuilding and repair, fish canning, iron working and the manufacture of cement, textiles and other goods. Maputo is one of the fastest growing African cities in terms of development, infrastructure and population. Its population has been seen to grow rapidly since 2010. Trust me, this city is one to visit. Kindly subscribe to our channel if you are yet to, give this video a like if you enjoyed it and feel free to drop a comment in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.